Science, 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 science. Well, hello, scientist. How are you Greg, doing? Please come in. Um, how's that placebo for erectile dysfunction going? I think I accidentally made the real kind. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm, yes. I was working on heart's medication, but it just turns out that the blood goes right to the penis. Hmm. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, what about male birth control? I heard we we're getting pretty close on that. Hmm, yes, of course. Hmm. When all other men are sterile. We will have all the ladies, us scientists. Hmm, I think I had a breakthrough. Really? You were just working on that for five seconds. I think you're a liar and I'm leaving. Oh, hello there, Dr. Hansen. How are you doing? Handsome. Yeah, Vincent Price just wandered in here. Understood, I'll take care of him. Hmm. Hmm, my name is Professor Hansom, and that name can be very misleading. Mr. Price. Uh, Mr. Hansen, very nice to see you again. Hmm, it's actually pronounced handsome. But I have a couple questions about, you know, why are you still here and why are you trying to do science stuff? <laughs> this was my experiment from the very beginning, offering a science position to a non-scientist. Do you understand? Mm, oh, yes. Mm, well then, can you just get out of here, please? Can't you see that I'm just trying to make a pill on the same equivalent as men riding bikes for long distances? The practical applications are there, and it's totally plausible. Short-sighted success is not good in the long term. You know that, right? Mm -hmm. Well, I guess you're right. But I'm getting really close to this. Uh, I'm tired of these excuses you make. You can't honestly believe you're a real scientist. Hmm, that's a very sophomore theory that you've just made. I went to online university to get my PhDs. <laughs> do you even know what a PhD stands for? Hmm? Well, of course I do. PhDs these nuts. <laughs> oh, come on, that's not really funny. Ugh, they already have male birth control, don't you know that? Well, they have a thing for everything these days, but not the greatest things. Ugh, I feel like talking to you. It's such a waste of time. It feels completely pointless. Well, then please leave. Like talking to a wall or something like that. I had my struggles too, you know. Well, not everyone can pass the MCATs like me. Ugh, you just don't know what it's like to be this handsome. They were just going to let me pass just by being handsome. But I studied hard, and I got the test, and I did the test. Hmm, well, why don't you take a look? Man, I don't want to take a look at your Petri dish. It's not, n it's nothing. It's not nothing. Ugh, you don't even sound why like... Why don't you trust me? Okay. Hmm. Ah, oh, jeez, come on. No, 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 keep looking. It's really interesting. You, you'd you like it. It's really cool. These are great oh, germs. You can't just grab a petri dish and just look at it and say it's science? Well, technically you can, but in this in instance, it's this is not science. This is just junk. Well, isn't science just junk you don't understand yet? Mm, I don't know about that. I hate actors.